Most of the courses that we offer form the scientific foundation for many of the students. To have a good understanding of the world around you, you need to be able to understand it at, at some level from a chemical perspective. Whether that's studying physics, whether it's studying biology, whether it's studying human physiology. I transferred from art to chemistry because it turns out I loved it so much and the teachers are very passionate and knowledgeable about the subject. We get a lot of engineers coming through the department. We get a lot of pre-professional students, the ones who want to go into vet school or pharmacy school or med school. So we get a broad range of majors coming through here. We learn a lot of theory in class and then we take that theory and we sort of test it here. You know, there's a lot to the labs. You get to use a lot of instrumentation, which is really good experience. So it, it really like strengthens your foundations in the material. I really like labs. I think labs are very unique. You get to actually do hands-on techniques that you're going to carry on. There's a lot of good opportunities to learn from your teachers directly since there are smaller classroom sizes. We want them to understand the theory as well as the practical applications. Uh, and the theory is important because if they don't understand how an instrument is supposed to work, what the data is supposed to look like, they could in essence get garbage out without understanding the background behind it. They get a lot of time on the instruments. They get to run their own samples, acquire their own data. A lot of universities, when they're doing data analysis, they just give them copies of spectra. Um, they never touch an instrument, they never get experience making up their samples. And here at AR, we think that that's a really valuable piece of chemical education. The processes that they teach you here, like the infrared machine and gas chromatography and ways to like purify compounds, it turns out that's actually how you do it in a lab setting. So I thought that was pretty neat that that's how real chemists actually do things. In the organic series is hands-on. You won't find that accessibility to instruments, especially some of the instruments like our NMR and our GCE. They just don't have access to those instruments at four-year institutions, not like what we have available for students here. And the FID when it starts to collect. So we need to turn that way down to like um, about two. Okay. You're just gonna type NS for number of scans. My goal after I graduate with my bachelor's degree is to go on to graduate school. I want to study medicinal chemistry. I feel very prepared. I feel like the standards that this school sets are very high. And from what I hear, a lot of the students from this school, when they go on to transfer to a UC, end up doing really well. We all are very, very moved to provide the best opportunity for students to learn because we're trying to get our students ready for what they're going to be exposed to out there. I really love my job because I get to interact with students on a daily basis. I get to expose them to new concepts and new ideas and, um, and ultimately help them achieve the goals that they set for themselves. The professors here are just outstanding and I can't see it being any better. 